Hello YouTube, this is Solomon Barajas and today we are going to be talking about the three shell game. More specifically the Deacon Dan shell set for those of you in the world of the three shell game who are curious to what they really look like and uh, kind of an idea of what how they handle and what to expect when you get them. Now these are the uh, street shells offered by School for Scandals and they're made out of a resin and some of you may already be very familiar with it and they actually handle very well. And these are the Deacon Dan shell sets which are made out of a different type of walnut and they are considerably smaller as you can see. And these are actually made out of real walnut shells and they sell for $150 which is pretty steep. And this is why I'm presenting this video for those of you who were thinking about it, weren't sure, don't know what to expect. Uh, here's a good look at what they look like because I know on the websites and on the forums they don't really give you the best description and here's a nice comparison so you can see what to expect. Here is side by side here. You get an idea of how much smaller it really is. Because of that size difference, they do handle completely, almost completely different. Also, as I'm told, as I talk to people who have played with it, I just recently got these. I will be sending them back. School for Scanner has a great return policy. Uh, I'm just going to switch it out for other stuff. I do like the, the sh this shell set, but I was curious about a smaller shell set, but it just doesn't work the same. Uh, with these type of shells here, you can always tell where the front is just because it kind of points you in that direction. With the Deacon Dan shell set, it's almost hard to tell the front from the back. And for those who know how they're constructed, it's uh, almost hard to tell the difference. With the tip standard, or the, what are people are most familiar with, this type of shell, a P is actually standard and will work great. For the Deacon Dance shell set, it's a different story. You need something closer like this and of this material uh, in order to, to play the game properly. So, you know, that's what you, you should expect that. Now, the inside of these, they are signed and stuff. As a worker, that's not important to me. But for a collector, I think it is something that's, it's quite interesting, without question. I think it is a cool looking set. I use it for working. I'm not going to use them. But I do think it's, you know, I think it's cool. I think it's different. Here's how much bigger it is. That's the inside of that shell. And this can just it's pretty much sit right in there. So let me give you kind of an all around look at this thing. Yep, and this is the front. This is the back end here. It's like a little hat. So it's up to you now if you choose to go the route of the Deacon Dan shell set. For those in the know who really know how to handle these, this might be something worth getting for you. For me, not in particular, but uh, once again, this is the shell set. The Deacon Dan Shell said, I hope this was helpful. Please leave comments, subscribe if you want, anything to support this, uh, this channel. All right, that's all I have to say. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.